Hey folks, Scott Kelby here from Kelby One Photography Training, and we are in Lightroom, and this is a follow-up actually to a post I did earlier this week called uh, Seven Little Known Lightroom Shortcuts. Well, we got a number eight, and this one is courtesy of Call Me Bob, who pointed out a shortcut that that I don't think I knew. And if I, if I knew it, I, I already forgot it. So it's, it's new to me and hopefully it'll be new to you. And it's very helpful. It is for the adjustment brush. So when you use the adjustment brush in its regular mode, right? Uh, I'm going to, I turn the mask on so you can see where I'm painting, but let's, let's darken the scene too a bit. Not like that much here. Here we go. So you can kind of see when I paint and my brush goes over the coffee uh, cup saucer there, you can see the red mask I'm painting over that, right? So I'm darkening that area of the image. So let's just take that off. So if you turn on auto mask, what happens is, let's make the brush a little smaller. What happens is it, it sees that, oh, okay, there's a different, you know, uh, object there and it avoids it and so the little plus sign see the little plus sign in the middle as long as that plus sign doesn't extend onto the saucer I can darken this area or affect this area any way I want really without spilling onto the coffee cup here comes the great tip let's turn off auto mask so let's say that I'm painting over here and your brush will go faster with auto mask turned off right but if you do get close to the edge of something you don't have to go over there and and actually, you know, toggle on and off auto mask. If you hold the command key on a Mac or which would be the control key on Windows, it temporarily turns on auto mask. So you just turn it on and it temporarily does it. And see, I am painting over the, uh, you can see my brush is extending over onto the saucer, but it's not painting onto the saucer. And that is because I'm holding that shortcut key that Call Me Bob told me about, which is the command key on Mac or the control key on Windows. That's it. Boom. Great tip. Now, before you leave, a couple of things. Uh, we are about a month away from Photoshop World Conference in Las Vegas at the Mirage. We are about 95% sold out on our room block. So if you want a discounted room rate, go to photoshopworld.com right now and grab your room so you can stay there at a great rate right there at the Mirage where the whole conference is. Three days of Lightroom training. We've got, of course, photography training, lighting training, everything else, blah, blah, blah. The second thing is, uh, if you're not doing anything this weekend, go over to kelby1.com, sign up for the, the plus plan. So it's 10 bucks a month. Sign up for a month, watch a whole bunch of classes, tons of stuff on Lightroom and Photoshop. Every Lightroom topic you can possibly imagine, it's all there. It's where people go to get really good at Lightroom. You should go there too. You'll have a blast. You'll learn a lot. And it's so ridiculously cheap. So go there right now over to kelby one. Dot com. All right, guys, thanks very much. Hope you have an awesome week, and we'll catch you next time.